Okay, you have been repairing mobile phones, you know about the charging IC, you know that, okay, it plays a big role in charging your phone. But apart from that, do you know the, any other function of the charging IC? I tell you what, the charging IC plays a big role in the phone switching on. I'm not going to be silent here, but I want you to understand that when you plug in the battery of the mobile phone, without the charging IC, the power manager IC wouldn't get the V-band voltage. This doesn't apply to all PCBs, but in most PCBs nowadays, the charging IC plays a big role in the main power supply of that mobile phone. When the battery is plugged into the phone, the charging IC receives the VBAT voltage and converts that VBAT voltage to the VPH main power supply to the MOS cube. And when it converts the VBAT voltage to the main power supply, it will then send the VPH voltage to the power manager IC to be able to switch on. So the charging IC is also known as the power manager IC because when it comes to some PCBs, for example, we have the Google Pixel PCB. Meanwhile, the, the charging IC works a, a whole lot more like the, the, the power manager IC. Yeah, in some uh, Google Pixel phone, you will actually see that the IC that received the VBAT voltage charges the phone is the same IC that keeps out the current to the power button. Okay, that's connected to the power manager IC also. You can check schematic diagrams to understand more.